Compressed Hair is a Warner Brothers cartoon featuring Bugs Bunny and Wile E. Coyote, released in 1961, directed by Chuck Jones and Morris Noble. And I have to say, as is usually the case with Wile E. Coyote cartoons, I didn't mind it, but I didn't love it. And I don't know what it is about Wile E. Coyote. I've never found a Wile E. Coyote cartoon that I've loved. Some of the others he's appeared in with Bugs Bunny, I kind of thought were okay. This one, it was well animated, and there were some bits of animation that I really liked. But the actual narrative, I feel once you've seen two or three Wile E. Coyote cartoons, I feel like they become very repetitive, even with Bugs Bunny in them. More so, of course, with Roadrunner. And there's just nothing about this cartoon that stood out to me as being that interesting. There were a few bits and pieces of dialogue, actually, I'll be honest. There were some things, there were one-liners here and there that I really liked. There were some clever bits of witty dialogue that, I have to say, credit where it's due, made me smile. But in terms of the actual things they're doing, the tricks that Wile E. Coyote is doing to try and get Bugs Bunny, I didn't think was that interesting. I didn't think it was that creative, certainly not that unique or that interesting. And I don't know why I have this aversion to Wile E. Coyote's attempts, but he just, he doesn't interest me that much. And it's a bit of a shame because whenever he's with Bugs Bunny, I feel like it's a good setup. He's a good, um, you know, he's got a lot up his sleeve and Bugs Bunny is very difficult to overthrow because Bugs Bunny is very clever. Um, but Wile E. Coyote is... Well, he never gives up. He is persistent, and I feel like he will keep trying no matter what it takes. But unfortunately, I feel like his efforts wear a bit thin quite quickly. So I don't have that much love for compressed hair. I didn't hate it, as I said. I wasn't watching it thinking, well, this is boring or anything. And there are some bits of dialogue that I thought were actually pretty good. But in terms of the antics, the things that Wiley Cowley tries, his tricks... Just nothing interested me that much. It's got 7.5 out of 10 on IMDb, which is a really good rating, particularly for a cartoon um, of this nature. But for me personally, apart from a few lines here and there, it just didn't impress me that much. Um, Wiley Coyote speaking is always an interesting thing. Um, obviously, we have Mel Blanc voicing Bugs Bunny and Wiley Coyote, and I'm used to it now. I've seen enough Wiley Coyotes with Bugs where he speaks that I feel I'm used to that aspect of it now. But with regards to it being entertaining, I'm afraid compressed hair is just not one that did much for me.